so here we are this is the culmination of uh, several months on and off throughout lockdown actually to mount up these engines which were um, my late brothers they got left at mum's house after he passed away all too young and I just wondered what to do with them let's get them going so I, he was a big car boot man so he, car boot sales I guess is where he got them Mammod Miner and then we've got two SE1s that's a superheated one an expert tell me that's a slightly longer boiler so I don't quite know what numbers these are Mammod Tool Station which is all my brothers and then I've since treated myself to a Wilsco D20 which is one of the Rolls Royce of engines um, and converted the whole lot to gas interesting little thing here bit of lockdown um, what should we say teaching my great niece and nephew their mum is a maths teacher I'm a retired science teacher so guess what we did volume of cylinder which is pi r squared h for each of the cylinders got that sorted so we know what volume of water goes in you then run them for a certain length of time having put uh, filled them two-thirds with the syringe brilliant bit of kit run them for 20 minutes suck the excess water out then you've got an idea of how long you can run them on gas without um, them boiling dry because with the mess burners they would boil dry before you run them out then you get a little kitchen timer set it up for 20 minutes or whatever they'll run for and um, hey presto you won't hopefully melt any of the boilers by running them dry with the gas if you get the gas low and the engines running slowly, they'll probably do about 45 minutes actually, but I've never gone more than about 20 minutes. So that's where we are. I'll use hot water out the kettle with the syringe, save some gas to boil them up, and also the boiling the water actually softens it slightly. It won't distill it obviously, but it will soften it. So these have had the conversion to the Bix gas burners. There's a Bix burner in here which is running off a little cylinder, but that all comes off. Uh, these three are all off this cabin gas cylinder. And that was the project which uh, took a lot of research on the internet but uh, I got there in the end and have had some success with it all. So that's where we're at. What I'll do now is I'll get them all going and then do a closer um, video uh, and talk a little bit about the conversion to, to, to gas burners which has been a, a total success really. That was well worth doing. So there it is. I've got to come back to the camera now switch it off, so that's the start of it all.